Weather from where you live. Live Doppler 18, the area's only live local Doppler radar is clear right now, and we're going to have a clear, hot, and humid evening, but I am tracking a cluster of severe storms that is developing to our southwest. We'll talk more about that here in just a second, but a lot of tools on the web. The weather information just doesn't stop here. Once I go off air, we've got high def Doppler and storm tracking under the interactive tab at WLFI.com, my blog, with, which has a lot of information on the severe weather threat over the next few days. And you can now follow me on Twitter.com, Chad Doppler 18 for weather updates. Okay, let's go to that cluster that's developing out here in northern Missouri. Right there it is. This will grow into a pretty big complex of severe storms through the evening. Race east southeastward and bring a pretty substantial severe weather threat to central Illinois, southwest Indiana, even down into Kentucky. Now, as for us, I think this cluster may sideswipe our area overnight, but looking at the latest analysis, the better instability is going to be in central Illinois and southern Indiana. Indiana overnight tonight. So as for us, I'm just going to go for scattered showers and thunderstorms increasing tonight as this moves off to our south. Our bigger severe weather threat will come tomorrow. And we can track that with live, uh, live Doppler 18 future cast. Again, this is tonight. This orange line represents that Boeing cluster of storms racing across central Illinois. This is 4 a.m. Again, some scattered showers and storms around, but the main severe threat, again, I think it will be west and southwest of here. Then we get a break before a new line of severe storms forms tomorrow afternoon. This is later in the day. It will get going in western and northwestern Illinois, form into a Boeing squall line with mainly a damaging wind threat, move through during the evening hours. We get a break tomorrow night. That's the first round of severe weather. And then Friday, a new round will evolve. It's really going to heat up by noon. I think we'll already be up into the upper 80s. A lot of heat, a lot of humidity. And there's the line developing late in the day. And this will come through during the evening with the potential of a pretty widespread damaging wind event. So there's tomorrow and there's Friday. Two days, two rounds of severe weather possible. 91 degrees on Friday, but Saturday and Sunday look dry and cooler before it gets pretty stormy next week. A lot of clusters of showers and storms. And then this is the big story. Late next week, the ridge expands a lot of heat back in the forecast. 68, some scattered showers and storms increasing tonight. Rain and storms, especially later in the day tomorrow. Highs in the upper 80s to near 90. Breezy. Again, we'll watch that severe threat. We've got a severe threat on Friday as well. And then drier over the weekend and cooler before it gets stormy next week with highs in the 80s. And by late next week, the heat 